So best is a scissor over comb technique, a large comb and a large scissor, so we can go through a good amount of hair. I'm going to angle the comb downward towards the back because we're eventually just going to shave over the back anyway. So I'm using the center section as my center guide. I can see it in the comb because I'm using a light colored comb on dark hair. So I'm going to take two sections on each side. Okay, so go across the top section. Now I'm going to take another section. I'm going to start taking the sections on the right hand side. I can always see the previous guide in my comb from the center. And then I'm going to turn the client towards me and take one more section. Angle that down slightly towards the back. And now in front here, what we're going to do, instead of cutting it straight across in front to make it look like we put a bowl on his head, I'm going to bevel the comb out just a little bit and cut the bangs this way. So what this is going to do is this is going to give us the option of combing the hair either to the side and work with his calyx in front there or just pushing it straight up and messing it up if he wants to mess it straight up. So I just want to go through and come from the side this way and make sure it's all even in the front. And that is the best way to start our top section. Now we'll move on to the round of the head section and prepare the haircut for going in with the clippers. <laughs>